Hey guys, um, I'm not sure when I'm going to be posting this, but when I'm filming it, it's Halloween. So happy Halloween! Um, I need to stop doing that. My whole personality is this. But today, we're going to be doing a... How to revive super dead, super bleached, super dry, super dead, did I say that? Dead hair. For the purpose of this video, I haven't combed my hair in like... I like to say a week, it's just been in a bun. So brace yourself for what you're about to see right now. I wanted my hair to get like kind of tangly so it would like be dry so I could show you the results of like my routine. things first is comb out your matted hair i'm not excited but oh i kind of forgot what it feels like to have like a hairbrush touch your skull and this is literally a bald spot i've had since i was like literally in middle school back to me screaming look how lifeless my hair is it looks like a looks like freaking nerves like a membrane or something like i don't know what you call it but i just and this is like a third of my hair there's still so much this is so terrifying you know what? i'm gonna finish this and then come back <laughs> I'm pretty sure, like I said, like I'm balding and my hairline's receding. Which is weird because I literally don't ever do my hair. Like normally only when you like slick your hair back a lot, you go, you start like having a receding hairline. And I literally don't, like I literally, all I do is leave my hair in a button for like forever. Like you know how like it's like a fact that you always have to brush from the ends to the roots. I just never do that. I'm literally a dog, like you know when people are like, and the dog's like, oh, this is gonna be so long to edit, but let me just show you guys the before. Okay, and now that we're finished the first step, which was brushing my hair, it's still like kind of getting naughty because it's always gonna get naughty if it's like frizzy like that. But now we're finished combing through my hair. Um, now we're on to step two, which is a mask. See you guys in the kitchen. So I'm not sure if I even mentioned what I was going to be doing now, but basically I'm going to be making like an organic mask for my hair. Yeah. So I'm just going to go get the ingredients. So you guys are going to see nothing. And so one of the ingredients is honey, but like this honey, it's like solid it's it's like solid like I literally just cut a hole in it but apparently honey never goes bad so I'm gonna try microwaving it okay I'm just gonna put this in the microwave for like 30 second intervals I have no idea why I'm chewing like that. Like, why am I chewing like that? Oh. <sighs> Honey. Okay, the honey is really hot and I don't want to end up cooking the eggs, so what do I do about that situation? So, um, I have the honey in there. I'm just going to start mixing in the oils because I don't want to like, I don't know. This is like, um, hair growth oil, 
black castor oil. L'espoir est un plat bien trop vite. Next, I'm gonna add some coconut oil. <laughs> This is like hair milk. The pump completely broke off, but it's like, it's called hair milk. It's just basically a conditioner. And we're gonna add some conditioner. I've been trying to finish this for like months and it's just been sitting in my drawer. It smells like lemon yogurt. Oh my face is so itchy. Oh, but it smells so good. I expected it to smell weird because like the mayo was This looks so wrong. Okay. I'm just gonna start. Putting it in. It's my hair. So now I'm just gonna apply this throughout my hair. It's kind of fun to play with. I kind of never. Oh, yeah, I need to change the shirt. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this throughout my hair and come back when I'm done. I'm gonna be wearing a different shirt because I don't wanna get the shirt dirty. I forgot to mention, but um, on the lower part of my hair, I'm gonna be spraying it and getting it kind of like less than damp, but still kind of wet with really hot water because I am pretty sure that'll help your hair absorb the whatever you're doing more. So now what I'm gonna do is get a mullet. What's this hairstyle called? Uh, tie it up here like it's not even in a bun it's just like I look like a troll like that and now I'm gonna do is just tie a plastic bag over it go to bed I don't know if it would be like the best idea to sleep with um, eggs and mayonnaise in my hair but we're gonna do it because I really want it to let it soak in or like whatever. So yeah, I'm just gonna put a pass bag on it, go to sleep, you guys are gonna see me tomorrow. So it's officially the next day. Um, I woke up a few hours ago, uh, like, um, I woke up a few hours ago. The first thing I did when I woke up was first off, brush my teeth first, but I washed the hair mask out. I used a Pantene shampoo and conditioner and I used these two products in my hair. Um, I used this directly out the shower like when your hair is like pretty damp. And then I use this. This is just like regular Moroccan argan oil. And I've been using this for like at least two years and it's literally halfway. I use like a dime amount for my whole head. And I put the conditioner first so I could soak in and then the oil to like seal it. So that's my hair as you can see. It's alive again and so if you like this video, make sure to subscribe if you're not already, um, comment whatever you want, and like it. Yeah, I'm still working on an outro, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching.